Hello folks and welcome to the Larshell Farm. You've got Mark and Mason here. Uh, I'm going to show you real quick what I did to improve on the feeders. Uh, I just recently switched over, not switched over, but I needed more space due to the amount of birds. So I went from these to the J feeders. Well, when the trough is fully open, just look on the bottom here with the amount of waste. That's in half a day, they nearly emptied half of that container. So I came in, noticed that, and I remember Terry pointed something out, but this is a little bit different than the way Terry did to his. I'm using one by one cloth, hardware cloth or wire, however you want to call it. I believe Terry used one by two. Um, and I'm going to show you real quick. There's no drilling, nothing needs to be done. And you can see the birds are still accessing the food, no problems. So I'm going to hand this over to my assistant. You got that, May? All right, I've got the J feeder here. I've already done a few of them, so I'm gonna show you on this. These are 11 and a half inches wide. So you need 11 inches of the wire. Take this end, butt it up against here, and the first square that's in there, just cut it off. So I'm gonna cut this off. This is all I have left on that, so it's gonna work out well. You could see how I have two legs. That's not gonna work. I need to have two full squares and just the legs. So I'm gonna cut these off real quick. All right, so you can see now that I've got the two full squares and just the legs. That's all you're gonna need. I'm just gonna take this real quick Empty this out because of those pieces I trimmed off. All right, I'll come back here. Just insert this right into the feeder all the way through to the bottom. This has a little bit of a V-groove here. You're gonna to wanna to pull that up into the V-groove. And when you do that, you can see the legs on the inside. You're gonna to wanna to take those legs. You could do every other one, it doesn't really matter. I do about three or four on the whole setup. And you can see that holds it right there in place and it's not it's not falling out, it's not gonna come out at all. So that is how you install those real quick with no issues. You can kind of see the legs that are bent and that's holding that up and it can't come down because it's caught in that tapered space. So that should help keep these little boogers from wasting all that food on the bottom. Thanks for joining us, and I hope this helps somebody. Right, May? Yeah. Yeah, what's the yeah about? All right, thank you. Hit the uh, like button, thumbs up, whatever you want to do. If you don't, that's fine, too. Have yourself a good day. Thank you.